Yes, we did. And they definitely did hear the shots. One woman told me that she was walking and she just stopped. She didn't know where to go, where to turn. She says she didn't know where the bullets were coming from or who was firing them. The sound of rapid gunfire and a triple shooting early Monday morning startled families in this West Baltimore neighborhood. All I heard was a bunch of gunshots and people just running all over the place. Baltimore City Police say just before 1 a.m. they learned about the gunfire through a shot spotter alert. It came in from North Duclin Street. About a block away, they found three shooting victims near an alley off of Oakhurst Place. A 22-year-old man shot in the head died from his injuries. Two females, ages 21 and 17, had non-life-threatening injuries. Brittany Ward says she was out walking her dog. Suddenly, she had no idea what to do. I was just like stunned, like, you know, I don't want to move or run, and I don't want to stay there, but you know, you just don't know what to do in a position like that. I just heard pop, 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 like that. And I was, it just scared me. Another neighbor who asked that we not show her face says the gunfire woke her up. I just heard a whole bunch of pow, 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 and I just jumped up and like, what in the world is going on? And then maybe 10, 15 minutes later, I seen a whole bunch of the police cars and, and all of that out here. And then I just had to sit on the bed just to get myself together. She says her neighborhood hasn't always been like this, but things have changed in the past five to six years. It's just getting bad. Okay. It really is. It's a nice, quiet little neighborhood, always been like this. Mm -hmm. And now it's a whole bunch of gun shooting. Her neighbor also says the change is disturbing. You're just hoping that you don't get hit because, you know, bullets don't have no names around here. City homicide detectives are investigating and they're asking anyone who may have information about the triple shooting to call them or Metro Crime Stoppers. Reporting live from downtown Baltimore, Barry Sims, WBAL-TV, 11.